What is going on guys? Welcome to a brand new Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing The Walking Dead Season 1. I'm going to be doing the whole first season, and then I'll go to Season 2 right afterwards. Um, I don't know if there's a Season 3 yet, but maybe there will be. I'm not sure. Um, I always wanted to brand... Well, not brand. But I've always wanted to extend the content on my channel by playing different types of other games besides Sims, because you can only play that game for so long until you get bored of it and stuff. So I wanted to do something different here and this is the beginning of new content on the channel so yeah we're gonna be playing The Walking Dead um, yeah let's do standard make more help because I need all the help I can get you know <laughs> knowing how clueless I can be at times and things I miss so there's five episodes uh, just like <laughs> life is strange I mean then there's a special episode 400 days which uh, I haven't gotten yet so I might get that when I finish with the whole five episodes here so yeah, let's start from episode one, a new day. Let it, let the apocalypse begin. I know it's been a bit overdue since I've done this Let's Play. I actually done a video on this before, but I removed it because I've had laptop issues. So yeah, with a brand new computer, should be better. Okay, be quiet now. The Walking Dead. Episode 1, A New Day. I reckon you didn't do it then. You, why do you say that? Does it really matter? You know what they say about reckoning. Why do you say that? Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually about now I get the, I didn't do it. Not for me, every time. And what do you say? Silence is a valid option. And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. Ooh, let me look around now. Look at it outside. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy hmm. and all. So you got an opinion? What do you think? You're from making then? You're from making then? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame that is. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. This cop seems friendly. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Sure. <laughs> Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. I'm just be silent here. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fellow, big soft eyes behind a pair of small folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I'll tell him he's got to stop. But that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Kind of sounds like Goofy. <laughs> so did he do it? 
They caught the fucker red-handed. I don't know. Stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less uh... depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Oh shit! This other time... <laughs> Oh my god. Oh. Uh -uh. Oh, my god. oh my god. Just scream that right when he's about to hit him. Oh shit. I said oh shit. Shit. Wow. Did he just get eaten? Kind of sounded like he did. Yep. Happening. Oh, that must suck. I wonder why we didn't get eaten. Maybe it's because we're good at hiding. <laughs> we didn't mean to hide, though. Oh shit! Thirsty. Ah! Fuck! My leg. You're in an accident and you just say thirsty? Use right stick to look around and find a way out of the car. Look at the cop. Hey! Hey officer! Are you alright? I'm still cuffed back here! Why would you ask that? I don't know, I just... Because I wanted to look at him. How the hell did he have his gun out? He does not look... He's probably dead. Uh, or he could be turning into a zombie by now because this is an uh, apocalypse. Anything can happen. Uh, Kick the window, yeah, get out of there. Move towards, okay. But seriously though, like you're in an accident, all you could say the first thing the first thing you'd say would be thirsty. I'm thirsty. The fact that he, he probably has a broken leg right there. Okay, we'll move along the car. Like an old man. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, we're still handcuffed. Oh, he has the keys, right? Can I take this? You never know. You gotta get your weapons, right? You gotta get the weapons. Let's take the shotgun now. Could turn any moment. Might as well shoot him. Looks empty. Then put your ammo in it. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Oh. Gotta do that first, of course. Okay, let's move a bit closer here. I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it. Okay, let's take it. Yay, that was easy. Oh, wait. I forgot. There was that. That always has to happen, doesn't it? It's... probably screaming at me like how'd you miss that shot I should do better than that Peter jeez okay we'll do it this time I'm sorry you had to see him get eaten like that blah 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 the stupid ammo okay take it now we're gonna aim we're gonna aim properly Let's see there that wasn't hard. That wasn't hard at all. Man. <sighs> skin's all rotten and he smells like shit. What the hell is oh, this? Oh, a figure. Who is that? Help! Go get someone! There's been a shooting! There's been a shooting. Uh, 
Yeah, let's let's run. Oh my god. Okay, I don't have to do it, thank god. Okay, we're safe. We're safe. Are we? Hello? Anybody? Oh, we're at a, we're in a backyard, of course. Isn't that obvious? Anybody up there? Hmm, guess not. Alright, let's go inside. Because we need some help. We gonna need some help. I just walked to it. Let's walk to it. Da -da 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 -da. Hello, anybody home? I need a little help. Just barge on in, you know. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Not an intruder, or one of them. Oh my. These people might need more help than I do. They need Jesus. <laughs> oh look, it's a coloring book. They must have a child. I wonder where that child is. Okay. Answering machine. Wait, let me look around. Oh, there's a blood stain. But pool of blood. Jesus. Things must have went down. That's for sure. Uh, you know what? Let's go. Let's go look at the answering machine, and then we'll take a look around while maybe that's playing. Three new messages. Message one. Okay. Left at five forty-three p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be Space. back in time before your spring break. Message 2. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. Hmm. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Marietta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Fallen everywhere. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Uh, Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. It's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's sad. Daddy? Huh? What in the world? <laughs> what is that? Okay, not in there. How about this one? Bingo! It's a walkie-talkie. Hey, yo, what up? You need to be quiet. <laughs> uh, 
Who is this? Are you okay? Who is this? Who is this? I'm Clementine. Uh, this is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. I ain't your daddy, I'm your grandpa. I'm so, I'm so terrible. Sorry. How old are you? Where are your parents? Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Kind of creepy. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. Is that Sandra? Is that Sandra? Because she's the babysitter, right? The, something must have happened to the babysitter. Oh my god, you're tripping over the blood again. Jeez. Come on, Lee. Kick her in the face. Yeah. Run, run, run. Oh. You're falling left and right here. <gasps> Ooh, a hammer. Oh, oh lord. They get smash your head in. Oh man. Okay. Okay, 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 yeah. Just pretend like we're crashing a watermelon open. It just has a face, you know? So if you're kind of queasy to gory stuff, I wouldn't recommend watching this. Maybe just skip the gore parts, but, um, Man. yeah. Hi there. Uh, that was violent. Did you kill it? Uh, I don't know. I think so. Something else did. Yes. Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. <laughs> yeah, I think so too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. Oh. Uh -huh. I think that might be a little while. You know? Oh, yeah. Oh. The phone call. Look, I don't know what happened. But I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Look for help before it gets dark. Get out of here once the sun goes down. Um, I think in the darkness is when it's really dangerous. But at the same time, you know, you're easily seen within, like, when it's, like, lit out there. Uh, but it's, it's just more dangerous to be in the dark because you can't really see much. And, I don't know, just, you just gotta think about this. We need to find help before yeah, think it gets about dark. This. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Safety of the daylight. Of daylight. Let's go. Stay close to me. Hold my hand. I didn't wash it yet. I just murdered a, a zombie. I mean, things don't matter anymore. It's a zombie apocalypse. Okie dokie. Well, let's go, Clementine. We have a partner now. A kid partner. Where are we going? Oh, dang, this camera angle here. Oh, let's leave. Yeah, we wanted to do that. Open the gate. Oh, look, there's two guys over there. Maybe they need our help. Oh, man. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. <laughs> and let's open the gates. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? They won't. Let's go. I don't know. Let's just say I don't know. Oh, no. Neither do I. Let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. It is, it is a very good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. We're looking for help? What are you doing? What is going on? Do you know what the hell this is? No idea. 
So you've seen them then? Oh my. You could say that. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. Same my daughter, Dad. Uh, um, just some guy, neighbor, her babysitter. A neighbor. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... The monster's coming. We gotta go. Uh, yeah, let's go. Let's let's make it chop. Let's go. Chop, 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 chop. 